Males here. 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 <laughs> They're here! After over a year of waiting, this box contains the Mistborn Metal Dice from Crafty Games. I'm so excited! So, we're gonna open it up for you. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We got the fancy version with all of the hips and doodads, uh, so, <laughs> packing slip, that's fine, yeah, okay, there is the complete Ferrukemi dice, Ferrukemi, I always say it wrong, gosh dang it, um, Alloy of Law dice set, the original Allomancy dice set, I pre-ordered early, so I got the like, first release of them. What's this? What's this? What's in the... What's in the bubble wrap? Ooh! Uh, some figurines for the Mistborn House War game. And the fancy leather dice tower. This is sweet. Okay, we're gonna open all of these up. Uh, I also got a tin for the Ferrochemi dice because it has different symbols, so I wanted it. But here, here's the headliner. Let's go. Here are the Mistborn metal dice by Crafty Games. First off, this tin is gorgeous. There's a slight embossing of everything printed on it. It's, that's very, very nice. Uh, let's open it up! Uh, somehow. Oh, gosh. Uh, it's on there. Oh. Wow! Those are gorgeous! Let's pop some of these out. Tin and pewter. So we've got the Pushing metal and the pulling metal, with the numbers raised differently. Oh man, these are so pretty. So the symbol is on the six, where the six would be. Those are lovely. Man, in order to truly test these out though, we definitely need to assemble the dice tower. But before we do that, here are the little figures for the house war game. We've got Kelsier and an Inquisitor. Those are super cool. I'll add in some close-ups. No, I want you to try. Want you to dry, fish. Want you to dry. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> the leather dice tower. It's awesome. This is the dice tray on the bottom. Uh, it's got Brandon Sanderson's Mistborn embossed in the the leather itself, as well as all of the alimentic symbols around the side of the tray. It's so cool. So that just snaps together like so. Et voila. And then this is the dice tower. And I believe the sides are magnetic, so everything should come together like automatically. Ooh hoo hoo. With velvet lined little tumbler thingamies. Yeah, it's all magnetic. That's awesome. So that just sits right in there, like so. Let's roll some dice. Oh, these have such a good weight to them. It's awesome. These look so, so nice. These are awesome. So yeah, we've got all of the, all of the alimantic metals, including era two and God alloys. Uh, this is really cool. So there's 20 metals in the, the actual metal dice set. And then each of the additional dice sets that were the, 
the stretch goals for Kickstarter also have 20 with the same uh, same symbols. However, the fun thing is with the the original Elementi dice set, it's got the symbols from like the beginning of era one, and then with the Alloy of Law, it's got the era two symbols, which have been slightly altered. Like it's it's really cool. And then of course Ferrochemy, it's got the ferrochemical symbols. These are really, 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 really lovely. I believe you can still uh, pre-order these on the Crafty Games website. I know, like, this is available for purchase still. It may not actually get to you for a while, because I know they're, they're trying to rush through all of the Kickstarter fulfillment, but it's definitely worth it. Like, these are gorgeous. So if you are into tabletop gaming, these are a beautiful set of dice that you can use for all of your D6 needs. Again, thank you so much, Crafty Games. These are absolutely gorgeous. I'm super excited to get some role-playing on. We are going to have, I promise, the Hemalurgy video is coming out really, really soon. I'm working on it, not right now, because I'm doing this, but I'm working on it right now. If you're watching this, I'm probably working on it right now. As always, please like and subscribe and leave a comment down below as to what your favorite role-playing game is. How are, your, how are you going to use these dice? Because they're so pretty. And I'll read and find out.